y'all with the fourth here, and welcome to a pretty, pretty cool video about the new official HTC Blink Feed launcher. Um, I am running it on my tablet right now. I'm going to show it off. I'm going to tell you the features, and I'm going to actually give you the zip, the zip file down below. And you're probably wondering, what do you mean by zip file? Well, you do need root at the moment to get this uh, this launcher. You do need root. And you just have to flash the zip file and recovery. I'll have the zip file in the description, as I said. So let's get right into it. Now, right now, I'm running Nova Launcher, so this is nothing. But you're probably wondering, why is everything so huge and out of order and not looking so crisp? Well, it's doing that because I had to actually increase my um, LCD density a lot. It's usually on 320, but I increased it to 420 just to make it look nice with the HTC Blink Feed, which I'm going to demonstrate right now. So let's go ahead and go to Settings. Uh, home and HTC Blink Feed. It's already on, so let's go ahead and just click the home screen. And here's HTC Blink Feed. Now, some stuff may look off because, for example, uh, I can't go any further out here and I can't move any apps. For example, can't move it over here. So that's the bad thing. But when you get this on your phone, if you have root and you get this on your phone, it's going to look perfectly fine. It's going to go with your uh, LCD and everything. But I'm not using a phone, so I'm using I'm using a tablet, so it's going to actually look weird. Um, but here is Blink Feet, the moment we've all been waiting for. I actually did look around at it. I uh, added a bunch of uh, sources. And in my short analysis, it's basically a big flipboard. A huge flipboard. And, um... Here it is right here. It's looking really, really nice with all the um, all the squares. Looking like a big flipboard. I just have to keep saying that over and over again. And go to highlights. You can go to different topics. Go to specific ones I added um, just in a short time. And you can actually search for content up here. I'm just going to, for example, search um, let's see NFL Draft. Let's just see what shows up. And it shows the NFL draft and some articles, photos, and videos as a custom feed. I do like the Jaguars because I am in Florida, so I'm going to see what they're talking about in the Jaguars. And here you go. So their draft grade is, let's just see how fast I can get their draft grade. And it redirects me to a YouTube video. So you see, there's a lot of different stuff here. Um, I'm just going to get out of that. But there's a lot of new stuff in Blink Feet. And this is, I think this is going to show well in the HCC 1M8. I think it's going to show up really, really well. I hope it does. Um, this is just what it looks like on my tablet. And, again, you have to have root to get this. All you have to do is flash the zip down below. But, so far, uh, I think this would look nice on my phone. The only thing I have a downside to is the app drawer. You can't really do anything with it. It's just the app drawer. Actually, this is the stock grid size, uh, 4x5. This is what it would look like on my tablet. And uh, it would look even worse on my uh, tablet without the LCD density changes, so I hope it looks better on the phone. I ha I've seen it on the HTC One M8, but I hope it looks better on more phones. I've seen it in some screenshots and stuff on the Nexus 5, so yeah. So, thank you guys for watching. Here we go with the fourth year. This was just a short little video about the HTC Blink Feet. Uh, I always have to give it a grade, but I can't really grade this one. It's I, I really don't know that much about it uh, as far as the uh, look for the phone. If I had a phone, I could demonstrate this much better, but um, I have a tablet, so it's not going to look that good. But so far, it looks pretty good. You see that everything is huge, so yeah. And you're probably wondering, you see Strike Team on the screen. When am I going to get a review out for that? I will get a review, a review out for that, as well as True Skate. A lot of people ask me about True Skate. Uh, when's the APK going to come out? There is an APK, and there is... A way to get free maps on iOS, but I just have to push it out to you guys. I'm trying, I'm trying. There's a lot of stuff, exams, EOCs, uh, tests, all kinds of crap. So I'm trying to get that out to you guys. You have to be patient with me. Uh, I'll make a promise to you guys. I'll get all the videos out by Friday. That's my promise. And if I don't follow through, you can unsubscribe. I don't care. But that's my promise I'm, to you guys. I'm going to get it out to you guys by Friday. That's my promise. So... Yeah, I'm going to try to do that. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Here we go with the fourth year. And that was HTC Blink Feed Launcher Review. Uh, all that's the good stuff. Going to have more reviews in the future. Uh, in the future, I did learn how to um, face cam. So if you guys want face cam, I'll have a poll down below if you want me to start face camming with my MC4 videos or not. Just It's really, really short. All I have to do is just go down there. 
click what you want, click vote, and then clear it out. It's nothing. So thank you guys for watching. This was HTC Bleak Feed looking really, really nice. And I hope it looks better on the phones. Uh, if you have any suggestions on, like, videos and stuff like that, please be sure to leave a comment down below. Don't be scared. I'll comment back. I always do. Even if you don't have Google Plus connected, I'll always get a comment back to you guys. So thank you guys for watching. Here you go for 14 YouTuber. And I'm out.